<laughs> Look, these two are stuck. Are you sure this one is ripe? It passes. I know this place. You sleepy? No, no. I'm just unwinding. <laughs> Works every time. Couldn't we go just a little bit slower? You should take the lead. Set your own pace. He's not giving up. Binging on flow. This feels familiar. 
Do you think it would enjoy a flow burst? Doesn't hurt to try. Ah! He moved! Maybe with a little more flow. There we go. Hey, guy. You could have just told us that you needed flow. Come on. Go put your butt elsewhere. If you see anything that seems salvageable for the nest, just scream, okay? Caught me a thread. Why am I always the one leak? This one should open. Should we just do the whole eyelid? I'll follow your lead. This place is totally empty. Maybe beneath the furniture? So, did you find anything? Ugh, a slate, a broken stencil, candy wrappers, and a... Capless marker? You? No better. A snack bag, plastic figurines, round tip scissors, and two capless markers. I'm wondering which planet is hiding all the marker caps. Let me see those figurines. Oh, <gasps> this is muffin and cupcake. Do you watch that stuff? Hmm. A children's cartoon about a baker's apprentice with magical powers? Okay, first of all, they're not bakers, they're pastry chefs. And also, Muffin and Cupcake is a cartoon about friendship, above all. And it approaches its subject matter with great maturity and sincerity, which can be appreciated at any age. So, are you Team Muffin or Team Cupcake? <laughs> That's a stupid question. I don't need to identify with any particular character in order to appreciate a good series. Alright, Cupcake. Cupcake all the way. Found something. Huh. I don't know this drone. Do you think that they developed a new kind especially to explore Source? Are you joking? It's a pallet jack. A what? Haven't you ever set foot in a warehouse? What would I do in a warehouse? I'm not even sure there are warehouses on top. Of course there are warehouses. Where do you think they store their stuff? In a stuff box? Come on, let's get this hydraulic cylinder back to the nest instead of blathering. What are you gonna use it for? We'll see. Hydraulics are always useful. If you say so.
Okay, a little bit of rust here and there, and that should be good. Great oaks from little acorns grow. What are you doing? Nothing. Just routine maintenance. The nest hasn't flown in a while. Does it really need maintenance? It requires maintenance precisely because it's not flying. That way, when it's ready to take off, it'll be fully operational. Are you gonna be a while? Why do you ask? I don't know. I was thinking that we might also need a little maintenance of our own. Am I supposed to believe that seeing my hands full of gunk is turning you on? Certainly doesn't hurt. Okay, but let me set some ground rules. No gear-based puns, whether it's about nozzles, cylinders, or pistons. Flange gaskets? Surprise me. Is this it? Apple's fast. It feels even crazier with your eyes closed. You had your eyes closed? This is giving me a great recipe idea. No spoilers. I wouldn't have gone this way. Besides the snide comments, do you want to lead? Actually nice to walk. Ha! Before you interrupted me, I was about to say, in small doses. You... I have some bad news. What? Oh, you found another seed, didn't you? Yes! Burble? What happened to her? That's not Burble. Huh? How do you know? She looks nothing like her. Obviously, right now she's covered with rust. Even still, you can tell their faces look completely different. Huh. Don't you see? Now that you mention it, Burble does look a bit taller than her. Oh, no. They're the same height. But Burble's head is more... Whereas this one's wings are less... You know what I'm saying. Yeah. 
Yeah. Anyway, whether or not that's Burble, we can't leave her hanging like this. We agree. Here we go. More rest. Hey, don't be scared. We just want to clean off this rust. Ready? Go, go, go! Boom. On your mark? Go, go! Maybe you should be scared. Too late. How about we load our attacks ahead of time? There's no way I'm letting that touch me. Stunned. It's go time. What a missed opportunity. We need to get on the same page. Too late. How about we load our attacks ahead of time? What a missed opportunity. We need to get on the same page. Now's the time to hit him hard. Three, two, Too late. one. Now. How about we load our attacks ahead of time? Ready when you are. What a All missed set. opportunity. We need to get on the same page. All set? Go, go, go! Stunned! It's go time! Ready when you are! Ready! How about we load our attacks ahead of time? What a missed opportunity! We need to get on the same page. Dodge this one! Love ya! Now's the time to hit him hard! Too late! How about we load our attacks ahead of time? It's time to find some shelter. Stunned! It's go time! What a missed opportunity! We need to get on the same page. Now's the time to hit him hard! Too late! How about we load our attacks ahead of time? It's go time. You? Yep, saw that. <laughs> We're that good. See? That wasn't verbal. Uh, yeah, yeah. All right, lady. You can go now. Why is she staying here? Maybe she wants to take us for a ride. Like, that's her way of saying thank you. We've hit the jackpot. Making headway. Good. Going kind of slow back there. Whatever. This one doesn't look very good. Let's not judge based on appearances. Ooh, we were right. And voila. See that? Looks like there's some flow hiding underneath. Yeah. Weird. It looks like a flow bridge that's begging to pop out. Like a budding flow bridge? Perhaps. If we wait long enough... Or we could come back later. Fine with me. So, 
Where are you taking us? Nowhere, it seems. Maybe she's waiting for our go. Or some kind of instructions? In that case... Into the unknown. Talk about the unknown. This is something else. Why do you think she brought us here? Maybe... Because she needs our help? But we just helped her out. There are times when you have more than one problem. Hmm. Anyway, now that we are here, should we take a look around? Yes, sir. <gasps> it's gonna be all right. So, what is it? Lufakrits. I didn't think I would ever see one again. Why? Are they rare? More than rare. No one has ever been able to grow them in the apiary. I had a chance to study them once. Our lab almost went bankrupt trying to procure some. Huh. And what's so special about them? Everything. No one seems to understand how these plants work. They don't require nutrients, apparently nothing that allows for photosynthesis. Actually, to be exact, I shouldn't even be calling it a plant. What should we call it? Considering that we've never found anything even remotely similar, blue facrids. Okay. Can you eat it? <sighs> Somehow I don't believe that was a priority question for biologists. What? Biologists don't eat? <sighs> yes. You can eat it, but it's not very good. It's acrid. Oh, I guess I could have figured that out. On the other hand, it has outstanding medicinal qualities. We were able to observe some amphibians feeding on it in order to regrow their lost limbs. What? That is awesome! <laughs> I doubt it would work for us, but it probably wouldn't hurt us. Looks like the birds already had a crack at it. As long as they're leaving some for us. Hit him with a. F You're safe. That'll teach him. Are you okay? That didn't seem to bother him much. Got it! Now's the time to hit him hard! Yes! Nice one! Stunned. It's that go looks time. bad. Oh, Bloot! What a missed opportunity! That worked! Okay, we're getting the hang of this! You block, I'll hit! Sorry. Do you think they're sorry when they hit us? Your turn. I got this. Okay. Ooh. Well done. One to go. I'll keep them at bay. <laughs> Meet my boyfriend. <gasps> What's up? Getting tired? This one's ready. I'm on it. You know what to do. Yep. Done and done. We make a good team. All right. Let's chill. A nest. Look at that. Beautiful nature at work. Even covered in rust. 
The mom is still keeping an eye on her little ones. I don't think that's the mom. I think our flying friend is the mom. Then, do you think that's the dad? That makes no sense. They look too different to be from the same species. Kay, don't you see the empty shell? <gasps> he ate the baby. He ate our friend's baby. I've been trying to tell you. Oh, no, no, no. That's not gonna happen. Now that's an extractor. Exanova settled all the way out here? They've traveled billions of lumsecs to come to source. They're not gonna back down because they saw a sticky swamp. Are you following? Why wouldn't I? This one looks suspicious. Requesting permission to sample? Granted. Let me know when you're hungry. Okay. I'm hungry! Improve what, exactly? On, Muffin. The cookie gang has struck again! They're threatening to dump a load of yeast in the cakeful water supply! Oh no! That would mean... Yes! As soon as the citizens taste this water, they will start puffing up! And then they will no longer be able to enter their own homes! We must stop them! This is a mission for... Muffin and Cupcake! Da 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 da! Can I play? Not if you're gonna make a mockery of it, no. No, no, for real. I'm bored and you look like you're having fun, so... Okay. You can be Muffin. Have you ever watched the show? No, but I think I get the gist. Okay, so the Cookie Gang is threatening to contaminate Cakeful's water supply, and we need to stop them. Ooh, Cupcake. 
What a nice dress you have. Uh, uh, thank you, Muffin. I'm wondering what's underneath it. Uh, what are you doing? Oh, oh, cupcake! There it is. I knew you were just gonna poke fun. No, come on, Kay. Come back. I sincerely wanted to play dolls with you. But Muffin and Cupcake also have emotions, you know. Mm. Oh, Muffin! What is happening to us? Can't we zoom in on this thing? No. To be honest, this is really just a gizmo. You need much more precise data in order to pilot. What's this rocky chunk got to say? Well, for starters, it says it's not a rock. Really? It's not living, is it? No. It's not mineral or organic. So, what is it? <laughs> Going straight to the hard questions. But that is not how science works. How does it work, then? First of all, you formulate a hypothesis. Then you build an experiment to test this hypothesis. You observe, and you learn. Okay, then what have you learned? That I'm lacking imagination regarding hypotheses? One thing we know for sure is that rust particles scatter immediately when in contact with flow. I'd like to observe this reaction more closely. You can do that next time. Right now, you should go to bed. Already? What time is it? No idea. But I know I'm sleepy. And I want my snuggles before I crash. <laughs> Gotcha. How big do you think this planet is? I couldn't tell you for sure. I would say that it's smaller than Truth or Charm. Like... Could we maybe go all the way around it? Don't know. We would need to measure its circumference. Maybe with a gnomon. A what? A gnomon. 
A stick, basically. Okay, then just say stick. And how would you measure the circumference with a stick? It... no idea. I know that we could do it, but it's actually a pretty tedious process. I guess we'd be better off exploring Source by ourselves. Game on. Should we go out and explore? I would love that. Oh, you like scratchings from Mama, you, don't you? He prefers Papa K's. Tell her, Rank. Tell her you prefer Papa K's. Good thing no one is seeing us right now. <laughs> <laughs> 